News Channel 8 is learning more about an issue impacting domestic violence survivors in the Bay Area. Many emergency shelters are having to find a balance between the need and the lack of available space. News Channel 8's Nicole Rogers joins us now live in Tampa. Nicole, domestic violence can escalate in an instant, so availability at these shelters is critical for survivors. Jen, they can, and that's something that we saw play out last month with a woman who was stabbed over a dozen times by her husband. Now she's speaking out, hoping women in unsafe homes are listening. Crystal Bresnan is out of the hospital and recovering after police say she was stabbed 13 times by her husband. I honestly thought I was going to die there. I couldn't breathe. Um, you know, I could feel my lungs filling up with blood. It was terrifying. Her husband is Michael Bresnayan. Yeah, the suspect has not exited the vehicle yet. The same man officers say then pulled out an AK-47 and started shooting at police last month on Florida Avenue. But that wasn't the first time Crystal saw her husband get violent. There was an incident in April where he cracked my face open. Um, I have the scar here. And that was when I was like, you know, what's next? That's when she made the choice to reach out for help, never imagining what would happen next. I called the domestic violence hotline, and at the time, nobody had any type of opening. So I started to kind of feel really lost and hopeless. I was like, wow, like I'm, I'm really stuck. Eight on your side sat down with the Spring of Tampa Bay CEO Mindy Murphy to see how the housing crisis is impacting domestic violence shelters in the Bay Area. We're pretty much full all the time. Um, and when we are full and a survivor is in great need, we, we will try to work with the survivor um, to make sure that uh, she can be safe. But it can be really, really challenging because, you know, you, c you only have so many rooms and so much space available. Crystal ended up getting a room at an emergency shelter two days before being stabbed and is now giving advice to other women in unsafe homes. Just go. Just go. Find that strength within yourself because nobody else is going to save you. Now stay tuned here on News Channel 8. Coming up at 6, we take a deeper look at this issue and find out how you can help. Live in Tampa, Nicole Rogers, 8 on your side.